Welcome back. Good morning and buenos dias. We're here in downtown El Paso. We're celebrating the 100th anniversary for the Border Patrol and we're moments away with the parade. As you can see, people continue to line up and more and more action. But right next to me, we have Mr. Hernandez. You're a part of both the Honor Guard and also the drill team. If you can talk to me a little bit about it. Yes, ma'am. So the drill team is a competition team within Honor Guard uh, put together specifically just to compete on specific drill movements. Um, it's a long time. We've been practicing for months and months. We recently took first place in Washington, D.C. It was amazing. All the hard work and support paid off. Um, we'll be performing here today, our routine at 9 o'clock sharp. Uh, it's going to be fun. It's going to be amazing. How many times will you be performing? I know at 9 o'clock, but will there be another performance? Um, in El Paso sector, this will be the last time performing. So this is your last chance to come here and see it. Uh, we'll be performing in uh, Big Bend, Texas, as well in a week for their memorial as well. And then what should people be looking forward to for your performance? Talk to us about the performance. Okay, so the performance, you want to get a nice front row seat. Our performance is tailored towards that crowd. Um, just be ready for a lot of wow moments. Um, there's a lot of high throws, high tosses. Um, and we did it all just, we want to remind, we did it all for the families of our fallen agents um, to show our love and support. That's how we're showing our love and our admiration and just reminding them that they're never forgotten. And how does it mean to you to be here for the 100th year anniversary? Oh, it's amazing. It's amazing. Um, this department, this agency is has so much tradition. And to be here during the 100 year culmination of it, I see all the fruits of the labors of people in the past, our advancements, and them setting the ground foundation for us to become an amazing agency that we are. Yeah, and then that's a really great thing, especially if you want to come out here. It's a little bit windy, it's picking up, but the peak gust is not going to happen right now. And one of the things is how challenging is that for you to like toss over some of the rifles with the wind? Well, it is a challenge. Um, we're used to working in controlled environments for the routine, but we always prepare for anything unexpected. We will see the rifle move a little bit during some of the higher throws, just because the wind will catch a gust, and then we have to adjust on the fly to make sure we catch that in the right area. Well, thank you, Mr. Hernandez, you, and congratulations on all your success. Thank and you, what about the winds? So we are under the ABC7 first alert, and that's because the gust. It's going to be a little bit gusty today. Wind gusts up to 40 to 45 miles per hour, and it looks like the peak gust is anywhere from 2 to 7 p.m. today. But the high for today is going to be 95 degrees. When it comes to beautiful Las Cruces, your high for today at 92. We are under extreme fire danger. I know some of us we have been following the Bluetooth fire. What I am forecasting right now is this roughly around 3,300 acres right now that have been affected. These are southwest winds, so I am forecasting that the smoke should be po pushing more northeast of us. So as of right now, I'm not forecasting that we will have any of that smoke here in the borderland as of today. Here's our hour by hour forecast. As you can see, it's going to be a really nice, beautiful day. And the gusty conditions, our peak gusts roughly right now is showing roughly around 5 p.m. is when we will see those 45 miles per hour wind gusts. And for your Memorial Day weekend, 95 for today. Tomorrow is going to be 94. It's going to be a little bit more windy. Wind gusts up to 30 miles per hour, but nothing compared to today. Today, yes, it will be gusty, but when it comes to the dust, it won't be as dust, dusty as the most of the other time. So light dust. And the remainder of the week, we might see 100 Tuesday and Wednesday. And then Thursday, Friday, we dip down. We'll be right back. Stick around.